two is uh, slowly winding down, moving towards dark. We we'll had some dinner. I did find a piece of uh, lumber laying back here in the woods, and I'm going to uh, I'm going to set my jet boil on top of that piece of lumber, and let's hope we don't knock it on the uh, ground. Got my frying pan ready to go. I'm just going to have a uh, spam sandwich tonight for dinner. See if this is even going to work. And that would be a negative. We've got to fix that on there a little bit better. So the piece is supposed to screw right on here. If you just set your stove on. But it is not working out. We shall see. See if we can get it. No, I'll turn him around this way. No, see, keeps moving. That ain't no good, y'all. It's no good at all. Yeah, I think that might do it. Let's see. It's not going to balance up there too well at all. I'm trying to do what I can to make this happen. I don't know. I might just have to hold it on there. It's about like that. I don't. I don't know. We're going to see what happens. Anyhow, I got a spam single here. Should be perfect for making a sandwich. We're going to pop him open, throw him in the pan. Dispatch out of there. There he is. Perfect size for a sandwich, y'all. In the pan it goes. Now, Try this out. All right, we do have some fire going on. I will take that. Do not trust this to not fall on the floor or on the ground, I mean, so I'm just going to hold on to it just like this. It should serve the purpose. Ooh, gotta watch it. I'm gonna have to figure me out something a little bit better than this. I'm not gonna like uh, wrestle with this all the time. Turn him up a little bit. All right, we've got cooking already. Don't take long with them jet boils. Not long at all. Which is good. When I'm hungry, I don't feel like waiting around all day. There we go. I can kind of let go of it as long as I don't bump into it. Knock it on the ground. That little piece that sits on top of this jet bowl that you use to sit your pan on. I'm hoping I can get that off of there when I get done cooking this slice of spam without burning myself to get it off of there. And uh, that way I've got a serving of dehydrated peas with banana peppers. Right there. That's what's going to go along with my sandwich. Let's 
also did bring along some Duke's mayonnaise. So that will make for some extra tasty Spam sandwich. All right, he is opened and ready to go. Give this another flip. Yeah, this is just not going to cut it, y'all. Not at all. Wow. I had about four pieces of that lumber like that, and I could somehow, like, you know, I could, I could tie them together, you know, with a piece of uh, rope of some kind. Maybe use some paracord, make it a more stable surface. Yep, I'm not liking this at all. Oh man, that's going to be good. Without a doubt. Alright, well that's cooking up a little bit more. A little two-part bowl job here. Pop it open. Got some bread. Like that. There we go. Oh, I actually don't need that just yet. Getting ahead of myself there. A little bit of mayonnaise on here. Get in there. Slap the cheese on there. Booyah, y'all. All right, give this spam another flip here. Oh yeah, it's coming right along there. Well, well, well. All right, on that note, I think Spam is probably really about done. Yeah, we're going to call that done. Well, there y'all. You can see that very good or not. Throw that right on there like that. Take a piece of bread with my cheese on there. Put the sandwich together about like that. And there's a piece of grass in my bowl. Can't have that. Now I'm going to close it up and get the uh, serving of peas going. Wow. Spatula on the ground. Not good. All right, I am going to have to turn this off for a second. Got a glove here. Let's see if this is going to work or not. I don't know. I'm not too positive. Oh, it did. It comes, it's going to come right off. I'm surprised. Woohoo, watch it. You know, these gloves are leather. You can't, you know, grab onto that too awful long because it'll still burn you for sure. All right, now for the serving of peas, y'all. A little bit of coffee was left in there from this morning. And that is just fine. All 
right, there we go. Uh -oh. Now we need the knife. Slice open these peas and banana peppers. Try not to spill them. Spill half my dinner and I'll wind up being hungry. peas in there trying to escape that ain't happening I want all of my dinner all right a little bit of water oh, go figure no water come on now this is not gonna work out I just know it's not don't need a ton of water but do need some I'm trying to pour this it's gonna wind up spilling probably Too much water. Too much, y'all. Wow. What a way to go about things. Leave it to me. Not have everything all together. And then uh, there I am. I got to try to drain some of this water. It's too much. That might be all right. I don't know. We'll we'll see. Whoa, see there? Almost spilled it all, every bit. Now I'm going to be attracting bugs around here, which I don't really want to do. Yeah, it's the first time y'all saw this, you know, cooking going on in this little piece of lumber, and it'll be the last time as well. All right, let's get this cranked up to a quick boil here. And we'll shut it off. Let it sit here and rehydrate. Well, if I was actually feeling like not cooking anything at all, just not feeling it. Sometimes it takes me a couple few days to get into the groove, you know, of the adventure. We're up to a boil already that quick. Does not take long. We're turning back off. <clears throat> Move some stuff out of the way. Put the lid on it. Set it to the side. Get all good and rehydrated. That is what we are after. Where's the lid at? There we go. this up here all right I'm gonna have to figure out a different system and also need a way I'd like to just use my alcohol stove I'm gonna fry up a spam sandwich or a fish sandwich or something like that instead of using my, my jet boil that's really for my coffee or if I'm gonna have a you know a dehydrated meal get that out of the way Taste test the sandwich, y'all. Oh, yeah. Oh. Wow. Look at that. Wow. It is so good. Unbelievable. I'm just going to sit here and eat this sandwich, and then we'll uh, check on them peas, have a test bite, you know, see if they're rehydrated. And then I will let you all go. Definitely worth the trouble, for sure. Cheese is all super melted in there. 
know y'all can really see that or not, but jeez, two killer. So good. Also, of course, the last thing I ate, this, there was a oats this morning. I did have a, uh, a strawberry pig bar. There was actually two of them. I ate those as a snack, you know, earlier this afternoon. Wish I had a way to wipe out this bowl in my pan. A little piece of a paper towel or a napkin or something. I don't have. It'll just have to be the way it is. Wow, you know, you keep saying that, but the hell you on? That was killer. Let's see if this piece is too hot. No, oh, all cooled down. That's good. You can pick it up off the ground there. Now, let's test out these peas. If I can get this all over here without burning myself. Oh, I did it. I'll take that. Handy dandy spoon. We must stir. Might as well show you all to these as well. Dehydrated peas and banana peppers. Well, it was chilly earlier. That's why I have this flannel on wind and the air coming off of this water around here it's going to make it chilly but now I'm getting a little too warm I'm going to have to take this flannel off very curious if these rehydrated that quick or not Nope, not rehydrated yet. I'm about to let those sit there for a while, soak up a bunch more of that water, and it'll be really good because it's still pretty tasty, even though they're not, you know, completely ready to go yet. And I guess that will do it. I'm going to fill up my water jug and uh, sit around and wait on dark time. Won't be a whole lot else going on tonight. I decided I am not going to make a fire, I don't think. I'm just going to relax and wait for the night time to come and, and I'll probably get in the tent. So... I will catch you all later tonight for the red light video, and uh, we will close out day two on the edge of Appalachia. So far, it has been real. Pretty good place to go on an adventure. All right, bye for now, y'all.